Hey guys, it's Chris. Welcome back to my channel. Um, it is a really cold, like kind of rainy day. The sun looks like it's trying to come out today here in Connecticut, but it's cold. I got my blankie here. I'm freezing. Um, oh, just a little notice on my weight loss journey. I'm down another pound, so I am actually at the one. I'm a total down actually down a total of 10 pounds. Yeah, me! I'm really excited. Um, you know, it's been slow and, but you know what? As long as the scale's going down and not up, I'm all cool with it. So I'm coming to you today with an unboxing from my favorite boxes ever. Um, Mother Earth Creations. I did one early last week, I think it was, on all her homemade natural makeup absolutely like loving it I haven't done a look today I just woke up a little while ago um but I will do a look as soon as I have the chance to get made up and do that but um oh I also wanted to say don't forget to join the June vendor sponsored giveaway going on um uh, it's yummy melts is this month and oh my god you guys I did a vendor spotlight for them and Karen is the owner, really awesome, awesome woman, and pretty impressed with these guys, like, really, her, her, these guys, her, um, I'm, I'm really pretty impressed, um, really elegant packaging, and just really, really nice, and she's giving away a doozy of stuff, she's giving away lots, lots, and lots of stuff, so, um, I'll post a link up here for you guys, and I'll also post it in the about section, but, this is Mother Earth Creations. This is a combination beauty box and home box. And I am addicted to these things. I really, really am. Totally am. Um, Alexis and Lula Tour is the owner. And she cranks these things out. I don't know how she does it. Like I said, I just got the her Mother Earth Creations beauty box, which is her own makeup that she makes. Everything in it is all natural. You can pronounce everything. It's amazing. Um, this is a beauty box full of other beauty products, not that she makes. And the home box, which is always full of cute home stuff that I always find that if you get them and it's something that you won't use, you could pass it on. They're always so super cute. But a lot of times I get the stuff and I didn't even realize I needed it. Like, I'm kind of like, oh, okay, you know, like wow, I needed one of those and I didn't even realize it. You know, I could be go shopping for home stuff or have something, have stuff on my list and totally pass this item by and I get it in this box and go, wow, I really needed one of those. Didn't even think about it. But um, they're $15 a box. So these are two boxes, I believe, in one because um, it is a regional B. It says thank you on it. And, oh, this is so cute. Oh, Oh, this is adorable. So this is her card. I'm going to show you right here. Mother Earth Creations. And you can contact her through Facebook, just so people know. So there is her name. Um, Where's her name? It's not on here. Oh, yeah. Alexa Sindler. Um, or her, through her email. And um, this is... Oh, this is so cute. This is a Make-A-Wish bracelet. So I was looking, if you see, it's a little lizard and it's got string attached, right? And it says, make a wish bracelet. Put, as you put on your wrist, make a wish. When it falls off, your wish comes true. Or ankle, your wrist or ankle. And when it falls off, your wish comes true. That's so cute. So you just tie it onto your wrist and, and it's just string. So obviously, you know, like eventually you're going to shower with it and all that other stuff. But when it comes off you know, then your wish comes true. How super, super cute. I already know what I'm wishing for. I'm not going to tell you guys, but isn't that true? Like if you tell people your wishes, they don't come true. I don't know. Um, so it's a thank you more than words can say. Chris, a big thank you for your purchase. I hope you enjoy everything. Lex. Oh, the tie dye is the beauty box. The rest is the home box. Okay. So 
look at this. You guys, it's like Christmas. I This is why I love these boxes so much. And, like, look at this. So all the tie-dye paper is the beauty box, is the beauty items. And then the rest of the stuff is the home items. So I'm so, so super excited. I just... I don't know how she has time to do this. Like, I have to have her come over at Christmas and wrap my gifts. I normally have my daughter do it, but um, I'm going to have to have her do it. So this is just so super, super cute. Um, but I am horrible at wrapping gifts, but Alex is awesome at wrapping gifts. So, and everything is always wrapped and then bubble wrapped. So that's super, super, duper cute. Um, and these videos do take a little longer, guys, just because she does bubble wrap everything. And mm, everything is bubble wrapped also. So, I mean, such care taken into, oh, how cute is this? I was just mentioning, okay, this is so cute. So it's a little turtle and an, it's a mirror. And I was just mentioning I need one to be able to put right here next to my computer because I'm going to start, I'm going to start, I'm doing now um, makeup, you know, putting on makeup and stuff like that for my looks and trying stuff out and swatching them for you guys. But I like to swatch, not just on my hands, I like to actually do it on my face. So it's so hard with just the camera, you know what I mean? It's like almost impossible. So I need, really need a mirror. So this is absolutely perfect. See, she watches my videos, so she knows. She she just is amazing. So that's awesome. Um, let's just get down with the beauty stuff, right? We'll just keep going with the beauty stuff. And this tie-dye paper is awesome. I love it. I love this tie-dye paper. It is so super cute. Okay. Let me see what we got going on here today. I was hoping this was coming today. I was like, oh, I, oh, I woke up. I'm like, oh, it's Monday. It's gloomy. I still have to go pick up my contacts. I haven't done that yet. I was going to get all made up for you guys and do a video, but I think I'm going to get made up and do one a little later because um, I have a new jelly bean challenge to do, and Dante really wanted to do one. I'm just hesitant to do it with Dante because... He was liking all the gross jelly beans, you guys, with the, from the last one. I was like, really? Seriously? You were? Like, yeah, he was just chomping on those things. And I'm like, well, that's not any fun. Like, how, do, how can you like something that tastes like boogers? I don't know. It was gross. But this is a Wet n Wild palette, Art in the Streets. And this has really basically like all the colors that I love. Like, I love vibrant hues. So you have a electric purple here a blue and like an electric green a yellow and just this wonderful orange color love this love it love it love it um it's called color icon color icon color icon color icon eyeshadow palette awesome so and it's funny too because i'm also looking for the fergie fergie edition i guess the wet n wild eye primer um, people are telling me in a makeup group that they're, that's like amazing um, and it's so cheap as opposed to other pri eye primers because I'm really looking for a really good one um, that works really well. I have very oily lids, which is kind of weird, but because my skin's not really that oily. It can't, I mean, it can get oily, but especially in the summertime, obviously, but is that oily or is that sweaty? I think that's sweaty. <laughs> that's not really oily. Oh, and I'm wearing this makeup here that I can't stand. See this lipstick? Ugh, can't stand it. See what I'm talking about? It like, I put it on, but where is it? Right there. It's just by Revlon. It just, I have it next to my computer, so I put it on, but I can't stand it. This is sexy. What is this? Ooh la la. Sexy eyes. Oh, this is so cute. Up to 24 hour wear. This is by Physicians, um... It says it's new. Sexy Booster. Ooh la la, Sexy Eyes Trio. Let me say. She even tapes everything so that she can wrap it good. Oh, they're liners. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, this is cute. Okay, so there's 
a first I'll show you and it's got it's got this cute little case and a cute little um high heeled shoe sexy booster ooh la la sexy eye trio I can never figure out where to hold my camera anymore I need to get a new one it's like a hundred dollars for a new one um the one that I want and I just oh my god I have to get it um and I have to get new lighting I found that too but this is a felt tip eyeliner and then there's also an eyeliner pencil and then there's a coal eyeliner and these are it's called sexy eyes this is really cute and physicians formula I really like it um oh here it shows you the three right here I usually nor usually use the felt tip eyeliner or um the liquid eyeliner like just that just has a brush that's what I usually use but this is super cool. It's in black, I believe. What's it say? You can't see with these glasses on. Black. And it's got this cute little case. I'm not going to open this right now, but it's really adorable. Oh, and they show you how to create a sexy eye on the back. There are directions on how to use the three to create the sexy eye. So the eyeliner pencils for a lower lash definition, the coal eyeliner is for dramatic inner rim definition, and then the fill tip is bold cat eye definition. This is really super cute. I, I, I'm like addicted to eyeliners. I am just really, really addicted. So I am excited. And this box is huge, guys. Otherwise, I'd barely be swatching all this stuff for you, but I'm just, I can't. I just can't today. I will probably do some stuff. Oh, oh, my all-time favorite brand. Someone told me they sell these in Walgreens now, and I have to go because I'm out of the the wash, the mineral wash, Um, and but Alexis always comes through for me. The H2O Plus is like one of my all-time favorite brands. This is Targeted Care. This is hand and nail cream, and I just love this brand. I got one in like a birch box or a beauty box, and I kind of flipped over it. It was the mineral, um, not the mineral, the marine um, wash, and really loved it. She safety seals everything. She just tapes everything so it's like, you know, you don't have to worry about, you know, it coming apart or anything like that. This just smells nice and fresh. And this is a big tube, tube of it, too. Oh. Marin and I are so obsessed with hand creams, creams in general. Um, he's especially obsessed with hand creams, so I don't know. I might have to. Oh, it smells very aquatic. Like, it just smells very, very fresh. Not like a, um, you know, like a perfumey fresh. Oh, it just smells really, really nice. <clears throat> it's just nice and fresh, like you're nicely showered. <clears throat> Excuse me, fresh. Oh, love it. So hand and nail cream. I, I I always need this stuff too because, you know, I'm getting older. Don't want it to show on my hands. That is for sure. Really like it. Soaked in. <sighs> love it. H2O+. Plus. I, I'm addicted to this brand. I really am. I'm, I'm going to try probably get everything out of their line at some point um, just to try because I just recently, um, Alexis sent me the mask <clears throat> and I loved it. It was a, it was awesome. It makes you look like a smurf when you wear it. It's hysterical. Oh, more physicians formula. This is called Nude Wear, Nude Glow, Touch of Glow, Concealer, Highlighter, Touch-Up Tool. Perfecting Nude Pigments, Beautifully Bare Skin Effect, Skin Glowing Finish. I am addicted to highlighters, to highlighters too. Perfect all-in-one miracle tool that adds a touch of radiance to each stroke. Dark circles, fine lines, shadows, and signs of fatigue. <laughs> I guess she knows me. I'm always fatigued. Um, appear to vanish for a beautiful bare skin effect. I'm, I'm going to open this. 
just because it's so cute. You guys got to see this packaging. You got to see. Okay, first of all, it's like gold. It's it's like a bra like a rose gold color. The package. I love Physicians Formula. I, they're a little on the pricey side, I think, for um, what you call it for uh, a drugstore brand, but I really like them. I really do. Um, I don't usually gravitate towards them just because they are a little pricey. What is this? Oh, you know what? I think it was supposed to be a bow, but I think it got broken. But it's really cute. It's like a half a bow. I believe. I don't know where the other part is because this was all packaged nicely. I don't know. Um, But then this it has this little... I don't even know what you would call this. Can you hear it? It's really super cute, though. Love it. Oh, and so then it comes in one of these brushes. This is not my favorite type of packaging, I'll be honest with you guys. Um, I've gotten lip glosses like this. And you twist it up, twist it up, twist it up, twist it up. And then it goes into the brush. And the first time you twist it, it always... Oh, there you go. You always get like way too much, uh, but I will swatch this for you. Oh, this looks like it'll be a really nice concealer. Oh, and it's got like a little shimmer to it. Looks like really good for my skin tone. Really, 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 really nice. I like it a lot. So, um, oh, blends very nice like it. I 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 like it. Oh, here's the other part of my bow. I, I, I must have broke it pulling it out. I was, I was having trouble pulling it out. So I probably broke it. Dodo. I broke the cute pack. Yep. See, I'm breaking the other half now. Look, I just broke the other half of the bow. Chris is a dodo. Um, putting this thing back in okay so the bow was really cute and now it's bowless because chris just broke it i just busted it oh lord what's my issue Ugh. kind of weird packaging though i'll be honest with you like you know if you got to pull something out of a box why stick a bow like that there so i don't know kind of weird but i really like this so touch up tool it's really nice. Love it. 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 Oh, here is Wet and Wild's um, cherry picking. I think I'm gonna take my glasses off, guys, just because I'm close up so I can see you guys. Um, cherry picking. What is this? Wet and Wild cherry picking. This just looks like a lipstick, but it is my perfect color. I love it. It's like a red fuchsia kind of color i just i love this color i love it i love it i love it i love it let me see here i don't know if this is a nude if it's a matte where's my handy dandy knife well it's right here in front of my face I'm like i can see you guys without my glasses out don't forget call 911 guys if i hurt myself um and then the stuff's right in front of my face. I was doing, oh, and I was doing my jamboree, my jamboree nails the other day. Um, yeah, that was pretty funny because I just kept losing everything. Like when I needed my cuticle pusher, it wasn't there. When I needed my tweezers, they weren't there. It's like most of the time they were under my butt because I did it on the couch and it was just like, let me swatch this for you. Ooh. This is nice. This is not a, this is a highly pigmented, but not a very, this looks like it might be a long lasting lipstick. Yeah, let's put it on over to us. Uh-huh. Mmm. Love this color. Love it. Definitely has staying power. It's matte. With lips, I'm usually, I'm a matte to satin girl. I usually don't do a whole lot of shimmer. Sometimes when I'm going out, I'll do some shimmer. Mm. I love it. I really, really love this color. 
I love this. I am getting a caddy. Look at this. It's hot and sizzling. It looks a little more red on my lips just because I had that other stuff on. But yeah, it's pretty, it smudges, but it's, it's abstract art, you guys. Um, it smudges, but it, it really does have that little staining effect. Really super cute. And then I rub everything on my blanket or my whatever. I don't know. I'm washing these things all the time. And it's like, where does all this makeup come from? I'm looking for my knife again. It's right here. This has a little cute ribbon on it. Um, but it looks like it has some staying power, which is super cool to me because... I'm always looking for stuff for stains and stuff for the staying power. I like it a lot. We're watching a video. Marion hooked the TV up to... Oh, I just... Okay, I made half these along because I just bought a pair of these. For way too much money at Bed Bath & Beyond. Or at the Body Works. Body Works. Um... Because I love these. I had gotten one, but I didn't have a set. And these are exfoliating mitts. And these things are amazing. You put these on in the, in the shower. And you, um, they're just, they feel kind of like a, like a loofah. It's like a loofah in a, in a mitt. It's so cool. And then you just rub your soap in or your shower gel or whatever. And you just rub it along your body. And like, there's really no need for scrubs and that kind of stuff. I mean, you can certainly still use them with scrubs and everything, but these things are absolutely amazing. And they're in my favorite color purple. So the ones that I bought, I may move, I may pass on because I do already have a pair and they do dry very nicely what I do I had got one from Shannon from um oh god what's the name of her company she has a soap company oh she sent me a wonderful um moving in care package and I can't it's malicious soaps and she got me, she sent me one and I became addicted to these things. So then I needed another one. So then I happened to be in Bath and Body Works and, or the body shop. I'm sorry, the body, I always get those two confused. The body shop and they had them and it was like buy three, get three free or something. So I just grabbed an extra pair because um, I didn't have a pair. I only had one. So then I was switching hands. I had one on this hand to do like this side of my body and then one on this hand to do this side of my body. It was kind of weird. So then I bought a pair that had two. So I will probably pass these on or the other ones because purple is my favorite color. I think I got the other ones in blue. So I may pass the blue ones on or I will pass the blue ones on. In a random act of kindness, I have a bunch of those going out. Oh my God, it's crazy. I just have to get into that wax room and just go nuts. Um, because I was going to de-stash and I said, you know what? I just really can't be bothered. I, I mean, I certainly could use the money. I just can't be bothered as far as that's concerned because, I don't know. I just, I'm a lazy de-stasher and people want specifics of everything and it's just, no. Like, you know, if you want to give me who do you want and what kind of, um, you know, is it bakery? Do you want fruity? That kind of stuff. That's all cool. But like when you get really, really specific, oh, I love these. I have one of these. This is Mosaic Face Powder. Mine is actually all clear. This is in Spring Petals. This is by NYC. And it's all, see if you can see, it's all different. You've got, you know, your powder and your highlighter and your blusher and all that kind of, and you just mix them all together and it just really comes out as a really cool face color. I love these things. I have one, but it's all nudes. It's, it's just a face powder, face powder. This one I think would be more of like a blusher kind of face powder or brightening face powder. Really super cool. You can never have too many face powders. I'm sorry. You just can't, in my opinion. You're always looking for a face powder. Okay. So next is... Da -da -da -da! Is... Oh, so I was telling you. So, we... so Mary comes up with this idea to, hit, to hang... Um, not hang. Took the computer up to our 80-inch television... 
and watch my YouTubes on 80 inches of television. And let me tell you, it was weird. I was like, really? We have to do this? It's just kind of odd to me. Um, but it, it was a little weird. It was a little weird. So he was laughing when I was doing, making these little faces and stuff like that. But I was like, can we turn this off now? Like, you know, um, cause one of my, um, YouTube fam was telling me she got, um, her Roku, uh, hooked up to her television. So she posted a picture of me on television. I'm like, am I on television? She's like, yeah. She's like, we don't have like, you know, um, regular cable or anything like that. So I just got, you know, we got the Roku and now I can, um, watch YouTube through the Roku and my father has that too, which, I mean, he's got cable and all that other stuff, so I'm not really sure why. I have a smart TV, so I, I don't know. So I already get Netflix with my TV, but, um, so this is a exfoliating body wash, but it was weird, guys, seeing yourself on 80 inches of television. Like, it was kind of weird. <laughs> it was weird. I'm not going to lie. Um, so this is Coconut Milk by Wish, exfoliating body wash. I love exfoliating anything. Um, this is coconut milk. It says exfoliate, sugar cane, lemon, and green tea, panthenol, organic shea butter, coconut oil, cleanses, oak kernel extract, and glycerin, pa pa paraben-free, sulfate-free, DEA and TEA-free, um, petrochemical-free, naturally sourced and organic ingredients. Love it. I just have to check here because when, when you get to the all natural, all natural stuff, I have to make sure there is no hemp in here whatsoever because they have bamboo powder, they have mandarin and tangerine peel, uh, bitter orange, sugar cane, lemon fruit extract, orange fruit extract, apple fruit extract, green tea leaf extract, safflower. Shea butter, organic, okay. It doesn't look like it has, doesn't look like it has any. Oh, it smells just like coconuts. Coconuts. That has to be my new safety word. It's coconuts, not pineapples. I don't know why I'm putting a body wash on myself. Oh, this is nice. It is exfoliating, but it's not super, super duper, like, you know, where you're rubbing your skin off. But this would be perfect with the gloves. And it is getting off. Kind of. It's getting off the lipstick that Alexis gave me. It's kind of getting off the lipstick. Um. Oh, and it smells so coconutty. Like, coconut is, to me, is like, I would wear, I wear suntan lotion or sunblock or whatever smells like coconut all summer. Because I love smelling like coconut like suntan lotion. Okay, the next thing is, oh, this is so cute. Look at this ribbon. It's got little foxes on it. What does the fox say? I sing that all the time to Carson. I mean, we don't do it as much anymore. I have a video up somewhere where I'm, I'm saying, Carson, what does the fox say? And he's like, ring-a-ling, ding-ding. Quiet, Nana. He gets so mad at me. He's like, like he's like, enough already. You're annoying me. Sorry, that's my job. That's my job. Ooh. Alex, you're so awesome. Alex, like, knows what I'm looking for. She knows what I like. I'm addicted to... I've been trying out so many different BB creams. Um, I have not had a consensus. I'm going to do a consensus on all my BB creams. Um, and this one is a CC BB cream in light beige. All-in-one beauty bomb formula works to moisturize, prime, smooth, brightens, even skin tone, protects from the sun. This is by Epilel. Ep Epilel. Um, Aqua Tinted BB Cream in Light Beige. It says a tinted multitasking BB cream provides a flawless finish look with instant sheer coverage to let your natural skin glow through. Um, I love when they have, um, what you call it? This is an SPF of 20. You're good with 20. 25 is normally the lowest I go, but you're pretty good with 20. Um, so this is really cool because you can wear this underneath 
Like if it's not enough coverage for you at all, I mean in the summer this is really all I'm looking for. I really try to open these things without breaking the boxes, but for some reason Chris just rips in and, oh, it's pretty. I'm going to swatch it, swatch it right here. I don't know how Alex picks these colors. And I think we're kind of the same color. This is very nice, too. This looks like it might be a little orangey. I'm not sure. Of course, I'll have to try it on my face. You're not going to be able to see this, but because it's blended in really good. But, um, oh, I can't wait to try all these. I will give you a consensus. I, I have a notebook. I'm going to have a notebook going for the BB creams as to what are my favorites, which ones I would take, which ones I would leave, that kind of thing. Um, a few more things here for the beauty, the beauty. I just love it. I, I love her boxes. It's so cute. It's so cute. It's a diamond ring, guys. It's a diamond. She's proposing to me. It's a diamond ring. I don't know where I came up with that. Uh, it's not. It's a cosmetics. Skin food. Oh. Avocado rich cosmetic set. Avocado rich toner. And avocado, I know, is super duper good for your skin, you guys. I do not. I'm just looking at. Is there any hemp in here? I cannot use hemp. I don't think so. I don't see cannabis anything in here, but there's a lot of flowery kind of things. Oh, and this looks like it's a Japanese. This is from Skin Food since 1957. And Alexis is also into a lot of Korean makeups. Um, and... I think she's the one who turned me on to the Korean makeups. I have a BB cream too, a waterproof BB cream. Oh, this is a set. Okay, so this is the toner. Oh, and there, here's a royal honey toner. So there's two of them. There's an avocado toner and a royal honey toner. How super cute. Of course, you can't read directions because, you know, they're in Japanese or Korean or whatever. But that's really, really super cool. Love it. Because I'm always looking for toners that like just don't. She makes one herself. I'm so excited to try it. Have not tried it yet. I will be doing that in my empties or what I've been using videos. Um, let me see. There's a few more beauty things in here of her own. She does a royal honey uh, moisturizer. She harvests her own bees, you guys. Like this girl is superwoman. I don't know how she does it. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, seriously, she hand makes everything. Not these, obviously, but, you know, her own stuff. Um, but I'm going to be doing a look out of just her stuff. Oh, this looks like it's going to be right up my alley. Ah! Yes. This is Wet n Wild from Co Color Icon. Again, this is for face, body only. This is glitter. It looks like it's a... Like a cream, silver glitter. I am looking for, I've really been looking at the Too Faced Eye Primer. Look at this. Ah, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Love it. I like to just put a little, like, you know, on the corner of my eyes. Or maybe a little in here. Just to kind of, or, you know, sometimes I like to line it with the glitter. But depending on what it is. Um, amazingness. Amazingness. I love glitter. Love it. I don't like it in my wax, but I love it on my face. So amazing. Um, Too Faced has it's twenty dollars though. It has this um insurance shadow, but it's good. It's the glitter adhesive. Um, people. Some people are saying it's hard to work with because it dries very quickly. But I'm so tempted. I think there's one more of the beauty. I'm so tempted to buy it anyway, just to try it, but someone was telling me that Fergie, Wet n Wild has one, has an eye primer, eyeshadow primer that is just amazing, and Alexis has one too, that she uses all over her face, so I can't wait to try that one too, just to, um, 
compare and find out what my favorite primers are. I had make I messaged a girl. She had a bunch of them, and I messaged her if she could send it. You know, send you know I'd buy them obviously, but send them to me. Oh, Sun Kiss Texturizer from Pureology Serious Hair Color Salt Free Tous Tousle Mist for Highlighted Hair Strengthening Anti Fade Complex. This is really cool. So it's like prep hair with perfect four platinum miracle filler. Okay. Mist, route damp or dry hair and tousle. Blow dry or air dry. So this is like for the beachy curl, you know, the beachy, you know how like when you just get off the beach and, you know, or you just get out of the beach water and then your hair dries and it's all tousled like my hair normally is anyway. <laughs> but it gives you that look. So this is super cool. So it's just a basically like a texturizer for the days that your hair is being just like eh, super straight and whatever. Super duper cool. Okay, so I think the next stuff, guys, is um the oh god. So that was one box, you guys. You guys, I got one, two, three, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Really, and and like I said, two physicians for oh thirteen. For $15, guys, I got, oh, plus the little bracelet, 15 stuff for 15 for $15, you guys. Like, and some of these things, like, full size, you know, high-end drugstore. I don't even know how much this would be. Um, I'm sure it's probably higher-end. Really amazing. Don't know how she does it. I don't. I don't know how she does it, but she bangs these boxes out, let me tell you. The rest, I believe, is, um... Um, home box. You know what? I'm going to leave it here and do the beauty, but that was the beauty box, and I'm going to do the home box next because otherwise this video is going to be way too long. But don't forget, guys, um, Mother Earth Creations, Alexis Sindler Latour, you can Facebook her, you can, I'll post her email down below. Um, if you want one of these boxes, amazing. And don't forget, she makes her own makeup and skincare line, guys. Super, super cool. Like, I was so thoroughly impressed. If you guys watched that video, I was like, nothing, no titanium oxide, no nothing in there that you can't read. It was awesome. Amazing. So thank you, Alexis. Mm -hmm. Love you so much, girl. Really do. Really do. Take care, guys. Oh, June vendor sponsored giveaway. Don't forget, I'll put a linky link in the about section. Everybody always forgets to click the about section. When in the about section, it'll say show more. So click that and you'll have all the links because people are like, I can't find the link. It's always in the about section. So do that. Talk to you guys later. Mwah.